Hey, YouTube family. I still haven't gotten that darn fan right. But anyway, <laughs> welcome to my channel. And hopefully one of these days, oh, it's even facing the wrong way. Let's try it again. Hang on. Pretend you didn't see that. Let's see. Is that right? Yep. Welcome, YouTube family. <laughs> it's Donna, and it's still not right. It's got to go down farther. I guess I'm going to have to get, like, I don't know. I'll figure it out. Anyway, welcome. This is Donna, and welcome to my YouTube family. And my fan is by Dirty Squirrel. Ugh. Let me show you here. D-I-R-T, 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 Squirrel. Um, it's a, it's an online shop that sells gay men's items. Um, if you want a penis fan, go to Dirty Squirrel, but this isn't that kind of channel. See, mine just has flowers. No penises. They also have some with sayings. And it's the only um, place I... See, that's the way the video is supposed to start. It's supposed to click and it's supposed to be like that. But it's going to take me a while to get it right. So anyway, this is going to be a What's in My Purse video. Um, I figured that would be the easy thing, easiest thing to start off with. Since I'm going to try to make my channel more active. That's what I want to say. Um, I... <clears throat> I'll do... What's in my bag? I will do... I have a video that I'm trying to get together now that tells about... Um, I live in an area of small towns. And... Oh, I forgot to put that back in there. Anyway, I live in an area of small towns. And I'm going to have a series of videos showing what we do in our small towns. And unfortunately, I had a hip replacement and it didn't take I overdid and it went out of place so I had to have a redo two and a half weeks later so I really could not go to any of the places that are going to be on the videos but I have I videoed them before I went out of work for my hip replacement uh, my my goal was you know to get videos of the places when they're not when they're not active, you know, like the sign, um, Hill Camorra, without people on it, and then to go back later when they were in full swing. But unfortunately, I am still out of work, so that did not get done. But, and I've been too busy feeling sorry for myself to do videos. So, this is what's in my bag. Um, this is a fossil Sydney satchel. I believe it is the original. There have been, um, well, there was the original, there was the original, original, then there was the newer ones. This one has, is pebbled leather and it has fat. So I'm not positive, but I think it's the very original. One, I'm not sure though. If I'm wrong, people can make sure to tell me. You can tell it's been used because, you know, quite a bit because, you know, the, um, it's floppy. I did buy it used. It did not come with the crossbody strap. Generally, they come with a crossbody strap, but I got it very cheap. So, I'm not complaining. And I'm, I don't like the ones that go this side and then. The other side anyway <coughs> if I use a crossbody strap I like it to be like in the middle I don't know if you know what I'm talking about anyway but <coughs> this is the second time I've done this video and I'm gonna have you pretend okay I forgot to put this back in here but pretend it was in here okay after I did the first video, I forgot to put it back in there. But I misspoke on a couple of points. And I don't want to... 
um, get people's names wrong or what YouTube channel they have wrong or any of that. So we're doing it over. Anyway, we'll start out with this. <clears throat> and my carabiner. Took me years to figure out how to even say that. Never found that out until YouTube. And all my rewards cards here. So I don't have to dig for them. I have this. I absolutely love this. I'm not into poofs or puff balls or whatever you want to call them. I don't, you know, I mean, they're okay. I have another one that's a cat. I mean, I'm into cats no matter what they look like. But this is Michael Kors. And I got it really, really cheap at the outlet. And I just love it. I don't know if you can see or not, but it's like a black... It's like hair. Like black hair with red. Which is my favorite hair color. So I saw that and I was like, oh, I gotta have it. I gotta have it. So, that's it. That's my poofy. And then, you know, I've been laid up. I've been out of work. And a friend of mine from the internet sent me. Um, I... Um, we did a contest and she made me something. She sent this along with it because, you know, I, I haven't been well. And so a little green bear. So I carry him everywhere with me. And then someone at work. I got to buy new rhinestones because the rhinestones fell out. But someone um, brought me this back from, uh, you can see right here, from work. Um, one of the mothers. I don't know if you can see that. Anyway, I never heard of it, but it's in Mexico, I think. <clears throat> so anyway, I like this bag because it holds a lot. I could really fit more in here if I wanted to. And I like it because the zipper, can you see? The zipper goes all the way down. And then you can open it right up there. And you can see what's in there. And there's my NYX lip, lips that, of course, were in there the whole time. You know, I didn't see me put them in there. So, you can see there's a lot in there. I'll take this out. I just got this today. We'll move this back a little bit. It's an Ulta Beauty Lips Vegan Leather. And it's got the orange zipper. I don't know. You can see all that. I don't think there's any sense in But I thought it was cute. It'll, it'll hold a lot. You can see I have big man hands and it's it's pretty big. And I don't know. <clears throat> I just got this today. So I don't know. These are the items that when I purchased it, they came in it. But I'm not sure if they're the original items that came with it. I don't know. But I really thought this was cute. And there were a couple of the items that I really wanted. For example, there is in here a sample of Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I didn't even see what, I don't even know, I'm assuming it's black. But I've been wanting to um, try the Better Than Sex Mascara because I've heard different, some people absolutely love it and they won't use anything else <clears throat> and other people say it's not worth it. So I figured since Too Faced is quite expensive, I would um, like to try it. So, you know, I paid the price of the bag, and then this was a bonus, so I can try it. And if you can see, there's little fake water droplets on there. And then we have... <clears throat> Maybe these did come in it, because they're all... No, some's Too Faced. Okay, maybe not. I don't know. But anyway, um, NYX HD, eh, I think it's porcelain. Porcelain photo, I don't know, I can't read it. I need new glasses. Some kind of concealer, anyway, in porcelain. And I can always use concealer. Cover up those bags under the eyes because I'm not a young woman anymore. Then I always wanted to try um, Too Faced Melted 
lip they call it liquefied long wear lipstick and I really didn't want to <clears throat> spend the full price for it because you know I don't know if I'm gonna like it and this looks like a good a good color for me and it came in the bag so I said no oh, it's gonna be worth it I think let me put it on my skin and see but I think it's gonna be a nice color for me hang on a minute here I'm very light-skinned oh that that was a little bit of overkill there hang on that was wow <laughs> that was a little too much but anyway look ma I have a whole bunch of lipstick on my hand I'm gonna let it dry down for a little while try not to get it all over me and see how it dries and I'll let you know all right <clears throat> Put this away before I make a big mess with it. And then we have NYX Soft Matte, Matte Lip Cream in the color Copenhagen. That's interesting. That reminds me of um, my sister's fiance when he was, when I was young. He used to chew Copenhagen. Anybody remember Copenhagen? Anyway. Um, NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the color Copenhagen. Um, I don't know if I'm going to open that. I might end up giving it to somebody else because it looks very dark and I'm very fair skinned. So that one I might end up giving to somebody else. So I don't want to open it. <clears throat> Sorry, my allergies are horrible. So that's what came in that bag. I think it's terribly cute. I don't know. Alright, then... We have, there's nothing in that pocket. Usually in the front here I keep my cell phone. But my cell phone is recording right now. And I can't show you the case because it's in the case. I should have taken it out of the case. The case has um, a little wallet. So that's what my wallet is at the moment. But... Don't ask me why my money, my cards, everything are in my phone case. But I have to carry my wallet because I love it. I'm a little bit peculiar. I like stones and crystals. And I have a little bit, you know, there's some, what am I trying to say here? There's some goth type things that I like. <clears throat> I don't watch TV and I've been out of work for almost for three months now. So I hang on YouTube. And I've been kind of hanging on the goth channels. And I bought my goo. Alright, I'm making a mess here. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna dry down. But anyway, I um bought my wallet from two goth ladies. Oh my gosh, I have all over the place. Ridiculous. I'm going to have to dig my wipes out. Anyway. Yeah, it doesn't... I can't wait to see if it dries down because I'm going to get it all over. <coughs> Sorry. Anyway. I used to watch... I watched this channel called... And the woman's... The channel's... It's Black Friday. And she goes by Black Friday. And somehow she had it on her, I guess she must have had a video about this wallet. Um, it was a collab with someone else. The wallet was made by Avelina De More, which is another goth woman. And she made it for Black Friday. So it's, it's, um, it's designed actually by Avelina De More, but Black Friday told her what she wanted in a wallet. So it's a clap between the two of them. That was a long explanation, I know. So I love this wallet to death. So I keep it in my purse whether I'm using it or not because I just love it. And it's vegan leather. You can see it's got vegan patent leather. Bat wing. 
And below that is vegan pebbled leather. And then, oh, you can't see, I don't think, the, uh, shoot, what do you call it? Now I went blank. The, um, hmm, crap. You know, the soft, fuzzy leather. Oh my God. Anyway, <laughs> sometimes I just go blank. Okay, and you'll open up the wallet. And I would like it much better if it was purple inside, but it's blood red. I mean, it's vampire, you know, blood red. It's got a pocket here. And it has a place here you can put all your stuff. Can you see it in there? And then it has the zipper pocket where I keep my change. And then it has a place for your checkbook. And it has pockets. I don't have my license in there right now because it's in my cell phone case, but usually it is in there. Um, since I've been laid up, I really don't have, I can't carry things around because I have a walker and I've been hopping on one foot with the walker. So I really can't carry too much around with me. <clears throat> And then we have, I'm hoping you can see, um, where am I here? Oh, over here. It says, you can see it's engraved in the vegan leather, Black Friday by Avelina Demore. Very nice. And then, this is the part that people are probably going to be really weirded out. I forgot to show you. I was going to show you at the beginning. On the back, we have a zipper. And it has the vampiric cross on it. Now, I am into vampires, monster movies, all that. You will find that out when you see my Reborn collection and my silicone collection. When I was a child, my sister's fiance and my sister, you know, my whole family and I used to sit and watch vampire movies, uh, monster movies. I think it was on Sundays. Monster movie matinee. So, I'm weird. Vampire movies give me, like, a warm, fuzzy feeling, you know? I mean, it brings back memories. Childhood memories. So, I can't help it. And I have my deodorant in here. I sometimes work 16-hour days when I'm working. So I always carry deodorant with me. And I have natural deodorant. And at the moment I have Schmidt's Geranium Flower Deodorant. And then I have my pills. <clears throat> this is a Betsy Johnson pill case. And it says XOX Betsy and it's got lips. And it's a very shiny, sparkly silver case. I love Betsy Johnson. She's an old broad like me. You're going to hang it. You know, you can attach a key to it or hang it on your purse, but I wouldn't leave my medication outside my purse because I have blood pressure and cholesterol medicine, so. I wouldn't want anyone to get into that, especially children. Okay, this is my backpack I got from Target. I found it in the... Mm, Cool section, I guess, like a year ago, probably. Got a little pocket here. And open up, and you can see I have a lot of stuff in there. First thing I have is my Nivea Milk and Honey Lip Care. Um, when I work 16 hours, 
I come home, I get a couple hours sleep. For some reason, when I don't sleep enough because I'm working a lot, my lips get really dry. So I have a lot of lip balms. <clears throat> this is for my allergies. It's a natural inhaler. It's like a Vicks inhaler, but it's all natural. I got it from the dollar store. Then I don't know why this is in here. I don't reapply makeup generally. I don't know why I put it in here. But this is my cat. Let's see here. Can you see that? My Cat Von D lip color. Studded lip color in the shade Lovecraft. Let me see. Show you here. It's, um,. I'm very light skinned, so it's a, it's a lightish color. It looks dark here, but it's a light color. <clears throat> Darn allergies. I'm sorry I keep clearing my throat, but. Then I have, what is this? Oh, yeah. Burt's Bees Honey Moisturizing Lip Balm. That's the only kind of Burt's Bees I really like, just my opinion. Then I have some Tylenol. Of course, I had to cutesy it up, you know. I got stickers on here. I have my Band-Aids because Donna, especially when she works 16-hour days and she gets tired, Donna is an accident waiting to happen, okay? cut myself with a knife, I'll fall down, I'll bang into, bang my arm into the wall, I need a band-aid, you name it. I'm just, I'm, I'm bad. Then I have my favorite lip balm. I always have one of these on my nightstand, in my purse, in my car. Especially in the winter, I can't be without it can't see it really it's not focusing focus hello not going to aquafina lip balm love it comes in liquid too i panic if i'm without then i have my tide to go stick you can tell it's been in my purse a while because it's the printing's all wearing off but i use that because not only am i an accident waiting to happen but I'm a spill waiting to happen, okay? Then, <clears throat> I'm 57. We have those hairs, okay? Sometimes when I'm working 16 hour days, I need to be able to um, cut them hairs down. So, I keep this with me. And then, this is the last item in here, I believe. Let me check. Oh, there's a key leash <coughs> here, too. I, <coughs> I don't have my keys at the moment because I'm housebound. And I don't need a house key. If you never leave the house, you don't need a house key. And I can't drive my car because I'm housebound. So, I really don't need to have my car key in there. But when I go back to work, they will be, or when I'm able to drive and get out and around, they will be back there. Put all this crap in here. That way I don't lose anything. Damn, I'm not putting back in there. <clears throat> Needs to go into my makeup. Okay, now. Bath and Body Works. Mermaid pouch. I love hologram. And we got a little tail here. I don't need another makeup pouch, but I just had to have it. And it looks really nice in my clear. I have a clear, um, I don't remember what brand it is, but I have a couple of clear bags. So I like to stick this in them. So you can't see what I got. This is the natural inhaler that I had in the little red backpack 
from the dollar store. This hasn't had the packaging taken off. You can see it says natural inhaler. Let's see what brand is it. It says, um, hmm. New choice. And it's only a dollar. It does work very well, though. <clears throat> then I have my... Um, I carry this with me. Sometimes I'll put it in salad or put it in yogurt or something at work. Hemp hearts, shelled hemp seeds. I got it at the health club. And it's you know it was free and they're supposed to be very good for you so I figured I would try them then I have my favorite little change purse it's real leather it's not vegan and it has a unicorn on it I like it so well that the uniform unicorn fell off so I super glued him back on there and he's been hanging in there I've had this for years and she's hanging in there I say she cuz she's got pink on her <clears throat> and my cotton now wipes. Tylenol with some hologram. I love purple and I love hollow. Just to fancy it up. Because it was a uh, Advil thing. And I can't take Advil anymore, so there was Tylenol. Hair scrunchy. Gotta have one of those. Unicorn. I also always carry this bag when I use my clear bags. Unicorns. And inside here, I have my Bath and Body Works pumpkin pocket bag with the black cat. It's from last year. I don't know if they'll have them this year or not. It's in the scent. Mm. Sweet cinnamon pumpkin. Okay. Oh, I'm going through here. I got this at the state fair for free. It's my mirror. It's not fancy, but what do you want for free? extra pills in case I forget to take my pills to work and then I have a hanger for my purse it has kitty 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 can you see the kitty and you know it goes on the table and then the purse hangs off the bottom there and it this folds right up like that. Very handy. And I think that is all that I have in there. Yep, it is. All empty. So, that's what I have in my purse. Um, I am going to be doing other... I'm going to get this channel more active. I'll be doing hauls. I'll be doing um, Ipsy openings. Uh, maybe I can, I can't really afford more than Ipsy at the moment, but if I ever get the chance that I can do other monthly boxes or bags, then I will do openings of those. I'll do um, reborn videos, silicone videos, um, pretty much everything. If I can think of anything that's like really uh, anything unique. The other people don't have. That's what I'm trying to. <clears throat> but I need to do a lot of videos and get my practice in and get some subscribers. So that's my goal. I was going to. Oh, and I have. Did I tell you this? I don't remember if it was my other video or this one. <clears throat> well, I'll tell you again if I already told you. I think I told you. I have a video that I'm getting together right now and it's um, my area of small towns. I don't know what the, 
the name of it's going to be, but it's about my area of small towns and things that we have, what we do for entertainment, what's going on. Um, you know, like we have the Mormon Hill Camorra is here, and we have all kinds of um, uh, like we have the Renaissance Festival, I went blank. State Fair, all this stuff. I was intending to go this summer, but I was unable to because, you know, my hip redo. I was out of work way longer than I thought I would be. So, unfortunately, I wasn't able to go to that stuff. I was going to do the book, you know, before and after what, you know, Hill Kimura looks like on a daily basis and show you what uh, the Peter Widmer farm looks like and all that stuff, but... I wasn't able to go to that stuff, so it's all just going to be, you know, what we have in the area and all that. Oh, my God. This took me 31 minutes? No way. All right. Well, I don't even know if all this will download on my YouTube. So, like, subscribe, share. I will get better, I promise. So, everybody take care. And have a good day.